A broad daylight shooting outside the Hyde Park Kroger March 25th sent shoppers and police scrambling. Tonight, the man charged 24-year-old Kevion Howes is back on the street. He posted $10,000 bail. Court documents say Howes was working at Kroger when he got into a fight with a person inside the store. Investigators say Howes followed the person into the parking lot, got a gun from his car, chased the victim through the lot, and fired at least four shots. The victim was hit in the upper back. Investigators spoke to us shortly after the shooting. It's stressful. Uh, you know, I mean, it's one of those things where you think that uh, you do the best that you can to, to provide a safe environment. Hamilton County Prosecutor Joe Dieters has been an outspoken opponent of low bonds for violent offenders. He says local judges aren't doing enough to keep criminals off the street. This is what's happening in your courthouse. And you wonder why our streets are out of control. The Blue Ash Police Department offered its support of Dieters with a Facebook post saying in part, while the majority of Hamilton County judges do a phenomenal job, please start paying close attention to who the judges are that allow these violent criminals back on our streets to victimize more people. Houses bond was originally set at $500,000. Monday, Judge Melba Marsh reduced it to $100,000 with only 10% needed if he paid cash. House posted the money the same day. And I reached out to Judge Marsh and also Hamilton County uh, Prosecutor Joe Dieters. Now, Dieters actually just sent me a statement. I'll have that at 6. I did not hear back, uh, or Judge Marsh was not available for a comment. Ashley Kirkland, WLWT News 5.